This is the last hand carved out of a block of wood. I'm gonna say that did. thing is beautiful. Yeah. Straight out of a block of wood. This is the last thing that I did for Castake that we never finished. Ken's got a little goodie bag. What number is that? Number three? AO3. Is that, is that one? That's AO1. Yeah. Wow. Here we go. There's one, two, and three. That's the first bait I ever made. Huh. That's the one that I said, you know, Chomp had an AC style plug. And I thought that was a really cool development in the beginning. What, what is, what is, is that just coated wire? Yeah, that's seven strand. Yep. And the problem is once you fish this for any length of time, it will actually snap that. that oh, wire. It'll, it'll break it. It'll break it. Huh. Yeah. But that was, that was the, the first bait. Here, here. This was, I think, number two. Wow. And that's surfboard material. So fiberglass and resin and yeah. foam? Shows you how crazy I, I was. What kind, of, what kind of a tail is that? Leather. <laughs> that is pretty innovative. Yeah, it's crazy. I don't, I is, is there much vortex coming off of that tail? I don't know. I, think <laughs> I scared more people with that than, than anything. This is the last hand carved out of a block of wood. I'm gonna say that thing is beautiful. Yeah. Straight out of a block of wood. Now, are you wood? Are you doing the wood carving, or yeah. is that somebody? Oh, okay. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Uh, no, that's uh, that's what I do. You don't you don't outsource that part. Okay. Okay. No. No. And uh, here's another early version. <laughs> and and have you you know, were you, are you doing the painting on those as well? That's that's hundred percent you. This is this is chomp. Chomp painted that one. Gotcha. I mean, I, lo I love the, the the. I mean, you got the the whatever the rainbow hue or whatever you call yeah. it, the, the flash, and that's beautiful. Yeah. Chomp Chomp did a lot of the painting. Uh, there was one bait. Ah, here we go. Early no bill. So meaning there's no bill to make it swim. No. Nah. And how does that bait fish? Is that a surface bait or a subsurface? Well, the ones that sank actually, you know, had a, had a little bit of what now are, to, you know, the S-swimmers. We didn't like it, so we didn't pursue that. It didn't swim as fluent as the ones today. It was m much more um, clumsy looking. Gotcha. But, but uh, what we used these for were surface. We'd rip them on the surface and walk them a little bit catch a lot of fish that way. And what, 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 what was your, what lakes were you, Castaic and Casitas or? Yeah, Ma mainly lower um, Castaic, we, we, that was our training ground. That was the place, okay. Yeah, but I mean, we ran from Casitas to Pyramid to Silverwood, you know, and Deep Diver. I don't know, you might want to picture that. Very few of these, there's only 12 made. And is that, is, did that catch fish? It scares fish. Scares fish. Yeah. That, that, Too much vibration. That gets away from the net. Yeah, I was going to say. Too much vibration. Ken and I have been having a, a, a healthy conversation about going back and forth about natural versus unnatural. And I'm, I'm seeing the light. I really am. Yeah. Oh, cool.